Hey everybody, I'm level 52 now. However, I had a what I think is a good idea for exploring the world that I would like to sort of systematically do now. Um, I my character here, Lunair, is I said, yeah, he's 52, uh, and I've been killing into more Deep for a while, but I realized that he doesn't have cooldown reset, and I've been you know, doing run-throughs of zones, and it reminded me of a cool quest and item that I've heard of but never had before, and that is called the Star of Eyes, which is a good cooldown reset. Uh, it's Identify, which is an interesting effect. It's it's usually for the Wizard Ice Comic quest, but it's something that everybody can use from inventory. E. Um, one thing about it, it's probably not as good as even a Spyglass, but I think it's going to be really fun, what I know about the quest, because you have to have a target, and it has to be within, I think, 100 range. However, it is a really good cooldown. Um, it's much better than not having anything, which I have currently. Uh, but the reason that I was interested in trying out this quest is I've never done it before, but I think it requires 10 or 9 ground spawns around Old World. Um... And once you have them all, you can buy them. I don't even think you have to kill anything to get it. I think it's just like a, a, a searching quest. And so I thought it might be kind of fun to try to go find those just as someone would do it in the olden days. I, I only know of one or two of the zones, and I only know where the lower Gok one is. So I, I, I was just going to, I wasn't actually going to look them up and go straight to it. I was going to try to find them and then explore the zone at the same time. So the name of the quest is called Tartan's Wheel, but I don't actually want to pull that page up because it's going to show me where everything is. Uh, and I'm trying not to look at it. But I know that this is the quest giver, Solger, or Solger, in Everfrost Peaks here. So let's go there first. Uh, I am right at fire pods to make this really e easy. I'm a druid, so I'm going to port around. I'm not actually bound there. But I want to go to Hallis, which is going to be down here. Fire pods. One of the coolest places in the game. I find everything in fire pods. I've said this before. By locating Greater Fate Arc, which is this one, it's somewhat distinct. And then checking it on the map, there's G Face, so Hallis is gonna be uh, this one. Alright, what do you con? Apprehensive. Okay, that's fine. Alrighty, so I'll do Hallis another time, but Hallis is, is kind of an interesting and small um, zone and city, but uh, it's, it's got, it's, it's cool. We'll do it one day. Is the barbarian place, and it's guarded by this very interesting and I would assume effective moat. Um, pretty easy to guard, and then this will take us to Everfrost Peaks, I believe. Now I want to explore this zone. But I'm pretty sure one of the locations of one of the ten things you need is... Uh, oh, wow. Are those ready to attack? That's interesting. Huh. Because I'm a wolf, maybe? That's very odd. Yeah, why are these ready to attack? That's odd. Huh. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta be careful in wolf form, because some things will attack you. Uh, just, why, why do you hate wolves, guys? I mean, I don't know. I guess you're like up here in the tundra. Anywho, let's go back into wolf form because it's way faster than anyone else. Um, I am going to explore this entire zone later. Uh, but I want to just get the quest first, because I think one of the pieces is here. Uh, Lish McMarin. I wonder if you can kill these. I'm not going to, but... Um, guards, possibly. Alrighty. Um, 
looking for. Oh, uh, so recently, like last week, P99 updated a, a version, and uh, oh yeah, I can just track it. My track is high again, uh, or not again, but for the first time. So it's now 125, which is max, and this will make things a lot easier. Um, certain things. Yep, you're all different. Okay, so this is the guy. Um, Salger, which sounds like a combination of salt and sugar. Uh, which sounds like a really gross thing that I wouldn't want in anything. But! Weird. Uh, say Tartan's Wheel. It's not how you spell it. <laughs> God. Uh, Tartan's wheel was a device that Tartan constructed to let him travel through the plains. If you were interested in helping me reassemble it, I would reward you well. Say, interested. Uh, Tartan's wheel was split into ten separate pieces. Those These pieces were scattered across the face of Norath. I have a tome that I can give you detailing the wheel of Tartan, as well as the wheel case that you will have that you can have when you are ready to assemble the pieces okay so i know this about the quest this wheel thing that you combine it in i think it's called glowing chest is no rent so you should wait because it'll just rot and what i'm afraid of or like when i log because i'm not gonna be able to get all 10 of these today particularly if i'm exploring them so i'm just gonna get to home boom okay i'm pretty sure this is what will tell me where the locations of the things are and i don't think i need to do anything else yeah they can be reassembled in a special case so when i come back i'll say case and get it and just do find them all first so fun fun i'm pretty sure one of them is here uh so that's probably the one i'm gonna do now and this will be the first video because i'm just, just gonna break these all into uh the explore classic everquest videos and have a 10 of them and then probably i'll make like uh, a summary video of just the wheel and all their locations at first but i'm gonna see if i can find based on just the clues where some of them would be i'll look them up if i can but i'm gonna try to do this quest as if it were uh, original and super fresh and it, like the game had just come out and like no one knew where stuff was so let's open this book okay the wheel of Tartan. Tartan had a wheel that once he built ten spokes to wood bound by a star. Tartan had a wheel to roam the plains shaped twice by ice to guide his way. Tartan had a wheel that he once that once he lost clash in the sky to earth he feel. Tartan had a wheel was sundered past the pieces scattered across the world. Anyway, okay, so yeah, there are ten rods, I think they're called. And I don't know where all of them are. I only know the location of the lower gut one. Um, because I've seen it before. And they're, yeah, they're just riddles. So, in the crossing of the waters rests a ship on its side. Crown sailors swim around it. Past the ship, the Aesir lies. I don't know where that one would be. In the crossing of the waters, um, Ocean of Tears, maybe? Rests a ship on its side. I mean, so this is all Old World. Maybe it's on the way to um, Fadewer. No, that's because that would be Ocean of Tears. Maybe it's uh, the other side? I don't know. Uh, in the land of wood, wind, and snow, this stream of water does not flow. Below the ice upon dry land, the Beza rests held by no hand. That could be here. That could be Everfrost. The wind of snow in a stream of water that does not flow. Maybe a frozen ice thing. Um, somewhere in here. Maybe there's a frozen stream. Below the ice, underneath, upon dry land. Interesting. Is there a cave, maybe, under the ice? Um, I don't know Everfrost super well, but let's look for it. That seems like it's probably this one. Maybe I'll read all of these. Uh, Kaza. In the Lake of Raids, so that'd be Lake Raids here, an, an island looms. It hides a treasure in its womb. A, a stone tower protected sleeps. Those who guard it cannot weep. Okay, so that's Lake Raids here. Uh, and there is an island in the middle. It hides a stone tower. So there's a stone tower. Yeah, so I, I think I've even done a video there. I wonder if that's where it is. So that's, yeah, okay, I can go there. A cauldron stews, but does not boil. Its edges rock, not dirt or soil. Inside the cauldron lurks a door. The Dana lies, some paces score. Uh, so that would be, I mean, a cauldron sounds like Drag Dragnor's cauldron. Uh, in between uh, the Kedge, Unrest, and, um, what's that, uh, Butcher Block, I guess. Um, inside the cauldron lurks a door. Is that like the entrance to Kedge, maybe? Or in the very center? Okay, I think that's... I can maybe find that one. Once trolls did live within these halls, then vengeance struck, their mighty did fall. A well of water upside down, that Ina rests, yet does not drown. Trolls? Is that the, um... Maybe that's Guck. Did they ever live in Guck? 
don't know that, but... Uh, or a Kazakh tool, I guess. No, that's ogres, though, isn't it? I don't know. That's, um... Crimson struck and white did fall. A well of water. That might be Guck. I'm not sure. The tears of Mar a pool do make. Two towers stand within this lake. In one tower, guarded high, the Fana dreams of sleeping dry. Two towers. In a lake. It's not Wraith tier? I'll have to think about that one. Um, okay. Uh, I have, to, I have to think about that. Upon the mountain, through the pass, the tiger roars with eyes of glass. The tiger sees, the waters fall. Geza is held under its thrall. Um, mountain pass, maybe high pass? Um, the tiger roars with eyes of glass. The waters fall. I mean, I, there maybe is a waterfall in, in high pass. That's my guess. Uh, under the city, upon the coast, tunnels stretch and secrets boast. Two dark pits within the ground. Then circle Hada round and round. Under the city, I mean, these are very cool riddles. This is like, um, the Hobbit sort of stuff. Under the city, uh, Quainos Aqueducts, maybe? It's Quainos on the coast, I think so. Alright, maybe Quainos Aqueducts. That's two dark pits, maybe? Okay. Uh, Isha, Isa. Uh, under the mountain where the sunless mass, the blind fish swims with eyes of glass. The blind fish sees through an azure haze, the eyes arrest within its gaze. Uh, yeah, I have to think about that one. That's the blind fish, I don't know that. Because there's, I'm trying to think of things that are in mountains. There's gotta be a dungeon. I mean, there's a lot of things that could maybe be that. I, I don't know of any blind fish. Upon this house was laid a, a doom. Its owners rise from beyond the tomb. Now sunken is a dwarven crest where the jaka lies but cannot rest. Upon this house was laid a doom. Its owners rise from beyond the tomb. Now sunken is a dwarven crest. What's near dwarven? Unrest, maybe? Uh, I know where some of those are. So here, the land of wind and snow. I think that's here. This stream of water that does not flow. Below the ice upon dry land, the vase of rest held by no hand. Okay, so I'm in Everfrost. I'm going to cheat and look at the map just to save time. Uh, I'm not going to find it. I'm just going to... I want to systematically explore all this. Hopefully it's not listed. Um, my hunch is it would be here. So, like, I, I wonder... This is frozen. And it says I on dry ground. So maybe under the water, if you can get through here, perhaps. So let's try that first. Um, and then I'll go around and I'll explore everything. Everfrost, um, so I can make a explore classic EverQuest episode at the same time. But this will be the perhaps Star of Eyes series of explore classic EverQuests. Just a good way to get ten zones out of the way. So this is going to be fun. So I feel like I have a good guess of about half of those, and I feel like I would have to like study a, a list of zones or like look at a list of zones to figure out some of the other ones. Because like I feel like I have a good guess. Um, like some of them make sense, but there's like a few zones that could satisfy this. Okay, here we go. Um, my hunch is, is water? No, yeah, this is just ice. So, my hunch is, what did it say? Okay, uh, does not flow below the ice upon dry land. Okay. Um, is there a gap in here? So maybe I'll just follow this. Anyway, Everfrost is a very cool zone. Uh, it's really remote. Which I don't know that, you know, it it's, you have to port? I think the port is North Karana. Um, and it's, that's pretty far. Ooh, Tundra Track is up! Abort! Abort! Tundra Jack! Okay, alright, well. I, didn't, I thought people killed Tundra Jack all the time. What if Tundra Jack's too hard for me? What is Tundra Jack for? I thought that he had dropped something cool. Is he just a fun dude? <laughs> No, I think he's just a cool dude. Okay, all right. Yeah, I guess this wasn't super important, but uh, I've always heard of this guy. I thought he dropped something. Maybe he's just renowned because... Uh... Ah, hi. Apprehensive and... Apprehensive, okay. Whoa. Is huge. Um, no, stop it! Why are you doing that? Okay. It said that Perforize used to be the lair of ice giants, most up and left for the icy continent. That is now is haven for ice. Oh, it just gives you lore. Okay, that's kind of a cool thing, actually, because that's. I mean, I don't know. I feel like a modern game would be like, oh, you gotta give everybody a quest. But that that's just a dude that just runs around, which seems more accurate than, like, most other games. 
Um, or it's just some random guy that runs around and gives you lore. Uh, it's kind of like a Skyrim -y thing almost. Um, anyway, okay, so that's Thunder Jack. Uh, he will fuck you up if in wolf form, and maybe that's what people know about him, is that he is giant and hits really hard. Uh, so be careful. All right, superior camouflage. Uh, I really like wolf form too because it has like ultra vision or whatever, and it just makes everything a little brighter. Halflings aren't a class that have really bad vision, but um, it is. That's one thing I like about EQ is it has things like that, like barbarians and maybe erudites and humans um, have really poor night vision, and like it's genuinely nice to have a one that just makes you. Um, see things a little better. <gasps> okay, there's a gap in the ice. Right, is, is that a gap in the ice? Whoa. Okay. Well, what's this? Goblin diver. Interesting. This is a perfect... Ooh! Oh my god. Did I just find it? I thought I just saw it. Maybe not. Maybe I just see something? Oh, is this the rod? If it is, that's so amazing. Okay, that was so lucky. I promise you I did not... Wait, I have no idea what this looked like. Nope, it's a barbarian. Okay. Um, <laughs> okay. That's not what I was looking for, but okay. Alrighty, well. Um, I could probably use some fish scales. One eternity later. Oh, smart. That's what that means. There's a door right there. I see it. Uh, problem is, I don't have um, water breathing. I don't have enduring breath. I'm going to have to go get it. Unless I just want to be stupid and just try it. I don't think I can get there, though. I think I'll die. Oh, well, maybe I can do it. All right, let's try it. You only live once. Um, I have pretty good swimming, actually, so maybe I can get there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. No, come on. Eee, stupid idea. Come on. I also forgot if you die instantly or not. Uh, I hope that you take damage before you die instantly. Oh my god. The thing is, I can hold my breath way longer than this. What are these people doing? Oh, thank god. Okay. I think I can make it. Oh, that was so scary. I think it's like, but what is this? Like, come on. Get some lung capacity, people. There we go. Alright. That was scary. What is a starn bear jumper? It's behind. All right, bear caves. Whew, that was so scary. It's gonna be harder on the way out. Man, that would be hard to find. I would have scaled this whole zone and never found that. Um, oh yeah, he is up, sullen. Okay, all right, be careful. Don't know, don't know. It is outside, I wonder, well, no, he's 61. There's no way I can harmony him, I don't think. Although his harmony might be unresistible, so maybe I could. Don't know. Don't know. There's nothing back here. Okay. Whew. Oh, that's scary. Oh, that's really scary. Oh, this does not bode well. See, like, if you were coming through here, you'd be like, what? That's... You'd probably think this was a zone, to be honest. You wouldn't realize that. You'd probably think this was permafrost. It's not, though, I don't think. Oh, God. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I'm scared. I'm so scared. That way. God, okay. Just follow the left. This is how you complete a maze, is just follow one side the whole time. Ugh. Oh, shit. There's a labyrinth. With nothing in it. Come on. I really like this effect here, though. Of the, uh, like it being brighter. Back in. Ooh. God, that's scary. <gasps> Even scarier. Uh, yeah, ready to attack. Fuck that. 
This thing could probably kill me before I get away. Even though I'm really fast. But he is indifferent. So there is a level 61 Necromancer that hits for 600. Is that all you're doing in here? What are you even for? Why is there a level 61 Necromancer that doesn't do anything? Eee, scary. Alright, okay. Well, that's the thing I need to really worry about. Um, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, 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 oh god. Oh god. Oh god. What is that? Why is there a Lich of Miracle? What the fuck even is that? Level 45. We'll proc a 1500 enormous aggro. Oh, it's for the Fiery Avenger. Oh my god. It's a really rare thing. Yeah, isn't this thing like almost never up? Hey, is a Miracle here? Wait, Miracles in here? Have someone charm the Lich of Miracle. Turn in. Whoa. Okay, that's scary. Um, that's an epic mob, and that would annihilate me. And I would really like to get out of here without dying immediately. Where is it? It's to the right. Okay. Maybe he just wanders through. This is really dangerous. <laughs> I don't think I really realized this to be so bad. And ice bones? God, I'm screwed. This is not where I want to be. This is a really dangerous place. Okay, so I got him tracked. More ice bones. Ugh, this is, this is a dangerous place. Ice bones are not nothing. go through there. I'm like, maybe that's where it is. Straight ahead. To the left. Okay, so I'm kind of far. The problem about undead is they see you. So like... Okay. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I was just trying to do something fun. I didn't say it was going to be all scary. This is like, I played this game called Thief, which I used to really love, uh, where you just like, it's like it came around around the same era, I think. Came out around the same era. Is there anything else in here? Rise spawns? Three for top again. Uh, come on. Upon, held by no hand. All that helpful. Like kind of a mausoleum y sort of thing. See, this is awesome. I've never been here. <laughs> Who knew there was just like a hidden thing? That's why EQ is awesome. Okay. Don't all attack me. Should really have like just a port up. Maybe Karana, because that's how I gotta come back here. Seems like the Lich wanders, and that is disconcerting. Okay, so it appears to be a head into the left. Seems like it's probably around this corner. So it says it has a gigantic aggro range, which is <laughs> definitely something you don't like to hear. <laughs> but that thing is right there. Okay. There's a wall. Wall in between us. It's good. It's good. It's gonna be behind. 
climb into the right. Good, good. <gasps> Don't be right there. Oh, God. Can I see him? Are you going to attack me if I run through you? No, there it is. I think. Is that the rod? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. No, probably not. Unless rods look like that for some reason. A dusty old jawbone? That's no help at all. Okay, I don't think I realized how many random ground spawns there were until you, like, started running around looking for them. is right there. Oh god. Oh, fuck. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm going to die. Uh, yeah. I'm dead. I'm gonna die. I must run. Now. <laughs> um, well, that sucks. Damn it. Fuck. That was stupid. Now I'm gonna die, because I'm stupid. Yep. Alright, well, that sucked, dick. So, Everfrost is clearly the most, I think it's the most remote place in the entire world, permafrost, I think. It's. Maybe there's something slightly more. That's part of it, too. It's like, God, the distances are so fucking far. Alright, so this is how you run to fucking Everfrost. It's across the motherfucking world. You you port to North Karana, and then you run west, and then you go across West Karana, which is one of the longest zones in the entire game, and then you get to Kano Hills, and then you go into Blackboro, and then you go into Blackboro, and then you go into Everfrost, and then you run across Everfrost. And... I love this game, and I hate it so much. God, I hate this game so much. This is normally so dark that if you're a class that can't see anything, that um, this is pitch, pitch black. Uh, now we're in Everfrost. Alright, maybe I can just explore this so I don't have to come back and do it. Um, so these are the ice tunnels, right? Um... This is Blackboro, and the, as I just said, that's like so dark that you can't see it. Uh, if you follow like the left the whole way up, yeah, that gets you to Hallis eventually. There's like some ice goblins and various other things in here. But yeah, it's a lot of like lower level stuff. This is like good newbie hunting area. Um, I'm not going to go all the way through every single one of these unless there's something super interesting here. Igloos, yeah, ice goblins, guards, um, yeah, just like low B stuff. Um, I think this stuff is probably from like a great way to get from up to 10. And they're, the ice goblins are maybe, that's, they're probably around. Alrighty, so yeah, it looks like this. Very cool, like, low-level low stuff like this. This is, like, where you'd run around um, to, you know, 1 to 10, and then you go into Blackboro. Good good newbie place, actually. Um, easy to get lost in here, though. 
I mean, it's kind of cool, like ice caverns, right? Uh, different than anywhere else I can think of. And then, so that's kind of the left half of this zone. Yeah, see, so like decaying, that's like a level one. Um, and, and, you know, these are probably like level two or three or something. Um, and then probably the ice goblins are like four to ten. I'm not entirely sure, but that's my guess. Yeah, yeah, three. Three. Yeah, oh yeah, they're really low. And then that, that makes your way over to. Um, oh, God. Um, Black Bro, which can get you to. 10, 12, and then you take off for, for other places. It's a good newbie starting area, uh, but you can see the way the zone is designed. Is uh, There's like this series of ice tunnels, and then, um, ooh, mid-level spawns. That's right where I just was. And then you have this other half of the zone, which is higher level, bigger stuff, like um, big polar bears, which are probably level level eight, you know, so like, you know, lower level stuff and this stuff is, you know, snow orc trooper is what. Yeah, up to 10. So, you know, this gets you, you know, and then what's this terrain? See, there's nothing even there. And then there's north and south towers. Megan's tower. Huh. Let's go over to those. So, you know, just like cool tower stuff. Um, little cherub face it's kind of creepy um but nothing specifically over here kind of kind of cool wait unless this is the tower oh is this i know this guy oh no i i take that back this is we're at seven um i know this guy from Kornov. i think i had to buy from him Yeah, um, yeah. Poison guy? What? Shaman spells, maybe? Yeah, shaman spells. Uh, this guy has poison making stuff. I was a shaman on Kornov, and I knew that from then. Um, alright, now I'm an idiot, so let's try to do this again. Viz. So, take two. Oh, there's tons of yeah. Is that under Oh, it's a kingdom. Oh, he's giving me IVU. See, I'm smart, kind of. <laughs> I'm smart when I'm not really stupid. Um, this guy's doing it. I may even watch. Okay, alright, take two. Run and get this shit, hopefully. Um, It's just not a bag. God fucking fuck you. Oh, good. Thank God. Yes, I got it. Okay, it doesn't actually get rid of my um, IBU. It's amazing. Uh, so yeah, they're gonna take out Miracle, which is like the big paladin fight of the epic, or one of them. Waiting, waiting, this is why P90 ratings terrible. Waiting, waiting, I mean, I guess you would do this for rating on any TLPs, but it's like 99% P99. That's why they call it P99. Pause 99. Mm. 
kill ant. No, I just killed the pet. They're charming it. Alright, here we go. Things are happening. Yeah, oh yeah, they charmed it. Now they're gonna spawn Miracle, I believe. Miracle is a BA. Getting the thing. There we go. Miracle. Alright, they're definitely annihilating this thing. Miragul! Miragul! Miragul's dead! Nice. All right, good job, dude. Good job, dude. All right, now let's try to get out of here without dying, and I'll go look at the rest of Everfrost. Hopefully I was recording. Yes. Uh, yeah, so that's the Paladin Epic Fight Miracle. You charm the Lich of Miracle, give him some item, I'm assuming, and then... Oh, yes, I have Dead Man Floating. I was like, I'm going to... Uh, drown, but no, you don't drown with uh, Dead Man Floating, which is both Lev and um, Enduring Breath, and a little bit of, I believe, uh, Poison Resist? Yes, quite a bit. Um, Alright, so let's look at the rest of this. This only took my entire afternoon, of course, as all things that are supposed to do. So here is the North Tower. It doesn't appear to have anything in it, um, but it's kind of a cool random thing. Piece of terrain. Ah, oh, it's under deck! Okay, not a time. Uh, but I guess it's frequented at least by a Tundra Jack, who's kind of a badass. Don't appear to be anything in here. So, what else we got in Everfrost? Um, yeah, okay, so I can just run down the beach here, and by beach I mean uh, banks, I guess. Uh, there's some ruins here. Doesn't say anything on the map, but it appears to be, just, you know, some terrain, probably some, a lot of green stuff. Although this is like a mid-level zone, or newbie zone, kind of. Although I think some of these mammoths can be pretty high. Um, I'll get Redwind in a second. I think he's a named orc. Uh, Alright, still going, still going. General Icy Tundra. Uh, there we go, there's the North Tower. Towery looking place. I like these cherub designs here. Nothing inside it. All right, now, I think these woolly mammoths might be like in the 20s or 30s even. These are the caps, but some of them aren't super low. It's just an icy peak. Oh, what's this? Oh. Huh. I feel like in, maybe it's Lost Dungeons and Norath. This is the entrance to, yeah, there's a, one of the entrances to one of the things in here, which is like kind of a nice use of just like, what the hell is this random thing? Temple. Yeah, just lots of random structures. Ooh, wow, cool. They're all they all have this random Ooh, very nice. Okay, that's cool. You got this giant statue here. Can I get up it? 
perhaps seems as though I might. This is like Colossus. This reminds me of Shadow of the Colossus. Anybody ever play that game? Uh, all right. Can I get up on top of your head? Perhaps. It's like Mount Rushmore thing going here. Right on the giant's nose. That's cool. Nice. Cool. I have conquered stone giants. Uh, all right. Uh, what we got here? Let's find you, Red. Looking for a bet. Track. There we go. It's Redwind. Is a named orc. Um, perhaps I can just snare you and pull you out. Yep. Uh, and then perhaps I can just blast you. Which light do you have, I wonder? Do you, can you live through one of these? Probably not. Oh yeah. There you go. You must be a... something. Red wind pet. Maybe a shadow knight? Uh, kind of a nice little pantheon. Uh, Roman style thingy there. Oh, maybe he's a necro. Is a Shadow Knight from Redwind for the Ivy Etched Bracer, I see. Not good. Fun though. Uh, let's see what you got. Ring of Ivy, do that quest, probably. Cool. Alright, well, there you go. Very under the. Uh, Iron fist of this stone giant here. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we get actual ice giants, which I think is. I don't know how much life they have, but it's probably. If you got all four, it's probably a good quad, to be honest. Um, let me see if anybody's taken them. But here, I see. Here's the entrance to permafrost, which is where. Um, What's her name is? Uh, um, Vox, obviously. Uh, and it's guarded by some pretty beastly ice giants. These things. Uh, they're still blue to me, and they could probably kill me if I was, you know, not prepared for them. People solo them, though. Um, yeah, there's a bunch. I wonder if I can quad these. How much life do they have? They have a ton of life. They're pretty high level. I wonder if you could quad them pretty well. If you had all of them, maybe. Anyway, um, there is a hidden passage in here somewhere that loops back around. So there's like this weird, random, um, whatever this is, thing. Long tunnel that leads from the north wall. Maybe it's just like an easier way to get into permafrost. That makes sense because Permafrost has some low stuff at the very beginning as well, some ice giants that are, or uh, ice goblins that are bigger, so probably like this is your hidden entrance. Oh, and it takes you to a um, another hidden tower here. It's cool. Um, where's this ice giant? Heading to the left. Yeah, I guess that's just the beginning of. Uh... Ooh, what is this thing? Itch ice roll. Summons Goblin Wackies. Cold Iron Quest. The Vredashaw. The Erudite Shaman 
that's that's cool. So here's something for a quest here. Anyway, okay, so that I think is most of Everfrost. 